this is the question of may june 2016 paper 1 1 and uh, question number is 37 it says that we have a, an electric a voltmeter is used to monitor the operation of an electric motor here's the motor the motor speed is controlled by a variable resistor so here 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 we have the variable resistor a fixed resistor is used to limit the speed so fixed resistor fixed resistor fixed and fixed resistor the current in the motor is gradually increased yes gradually increased in which circuit is the voltmeter reading proportional to the current in the motor so here in the first case we have let us uh, mark all the resistors here this is fixed resistor this is fixed resistor fixed resistor fixed resistor this is the variable resistor r v r v r v and again r v so let, let us see in the current as well so this is current i this is current i current i and this is current i so in the first circuit we have this v will be equal to current into the resistance enclosed here so it should be r plus r v so if we need that this v is a directly proportional to this i we must have this r plus r v fixed but the question says r is fixed resistor but r v varies so that's why r plus r v is not fixed and that's why v and i are not going to be directly proportional to each other so this choice is gone in the second circuit once again we have got here this v will be equal to i into into the resistance enclosed here which is simply r now the question says that we have the fixed resistor here this is fixed fixed means constant so that means v and i are directly proportional to each other as required by the question so this should be the correct choice let's go for others as well let us see in this circuit we have got this v is equal to is equal to is equal to let's do some editing here So here, uh, so this is V is equal to I into R V. But the question says that we have got to, uh, this is a variable resistor. So since this is variable, V and I cannot be directly proportional to each other. And in, the, in this circuit here, we have got this uh, v is directly equal to the emf of the source of the supply so this is uh, equal whatever we do with the current or anything else this will remain constant so our answer choice is just choice number b